Hi Libra, this is self-discovery support and this is going to be your message. The thing to remember is that tarot is not prescriptive and it's best to use this reading for energetic information that you can use to make the changes for better. Alright, so we started with the founder card. I drew this from the Citadel Oracle. This card kind of talks about you wanting to are you looking to maybe participate in a community maybe at this point you're ready to almost i hear as well like foundations um stability wanting to put roots down so you could be wanting to relocate you know you could be someone that is maybe moving wanting to set up a new situation for yourself that will become a kind of new reality or a new kind of grounding for yourself so it could even be switching jobs or not just jobs but like careers um joining a new set of people exposing yourself to new things but also yeah creating this kind of bigger thing outside of yourself I think is what I'm seeing here in this um, card. But let's draw some more cards and see what else we can pick up for you. Okay, so this is like a, a kind of point, it feels like, where there's a plan being made. Two of Wands. I almost feel like you're, like you found the thing that you want to invest in. You found the person you want to invest in. Um, I, but I somehow I think this is more about passions in terms of not passion to do with like people but passion to do with like purpose so that kind of six of pentacles is clarified by the king of pentacles so this is a lot of like i am ready to be generous and give to something in a particular direction i'm ready to receive in a particular direction there is the four of swords with the eight of swords so it could feel like you coming off of a period where you, maybe you were more self-protective maybe you were trying to kind of keep yourself in close quarters i don't know it kind of feels like you had like a a long period of just kind of like thinking just appealing to yourself some of you could have been in a recovery process from something that was much bigger before this and it just feels like right now you're in a very centered place you're feeling like you can give and not just give but you can make plans in a serious way ten of cups yeah yeah it you know for some of you okay some of you could be associating with an earth sign or a water sign so cancel scorpio pisces or capricorn taurus virgo but it does feel like you are feeling like now is a time where you actually just want to pursue what's happy <sighs> what was happy making if that's a word that's kind of my invented word but like yeah it's like not wanting to fight something anymore because you do have the five of wands here yeah it kind of feels like there's a kind of renewed passion or new passion for something here libra it's it's such a clear reading and i do feel like you're being led to this 
okay i'm seeing as i'm looking through the cards more i'm seeing that you're kind of almost like going through this kind of intuitive healing like healing process with yourself where maybe you're resisting hearing that you needed to sort something out for yourself okay i think for some of you you could have come off of a very disappointing um relationship actually one that really was trying and testing your energy you know it's like something that maybe you tried several times or maybe if it's not this thing it's like trying to be in a particular type of relationship various times and it's just like it's been so draining to you um five of cups is here there's claire regrets and claire kind of when you look back you might think you know what was that time for but i think that don't worry about that because you were learning lessons you were uh, let's see if i can describe it it's kind of like getting enough pain to learn to address it and to heal it so you could now move into this clear path so it's almost like phases in your life so this is like a relationship or even just your life path in general has been um one that you you know you there's a period of you wanted this situation to change because it doesn't feel like it felt good um it, it used a lot of your energy you invested a lot and i don't think you feel like you came out with um what you put in but i do see that you know the thing is you tried and so it's at this point now, it's like the founder, you've been through this kind of healing period and now it's time where you can really, you want to focus on what your heart wants to do and that can be, you know, you might want to travel, you might want to do whatever it is that is, you know, feeling good to yourself and I would recommend that as well. This nine of swords with the ace of pentacles. All right, so you might be having some worries about this. You know, there's things, there's logistic things. If you're switching careers, if you're switching um, places or locations that you live, there's some things you have to think about and figure out. And maybe after coming through a period where you are in doubt and you are in regret, maybe even grief for what you, what, what you thought you were going to have but didn't end up getting um it just feels like you are worried about some kind of new start for yourself but i do think that you have strong potential here i'm gonna just pull one card for you as like little advice All right, so it's the Four of Pentacles. This is one where I would say focus on conserving your energy, focus on conserving your money, saving, because clearly you're about to go on some kind of adventure or do something major here that is you following your path and your heart, but you are going to need that kind of practical support. So you might need to just kind of like be protective of yourself a little bit at this point. So, okay, Libra, this is what I have for you. And so if you like this, please do like, comment and subscribe. And I'd love to see you on another reading. Take care.